The Office of Queensland Premier Anastasia Palaszczuk says it's unaware of any health issues she revealed to news crews while holidaying in Italy. Brisbane Bureau Chief Adam Walters has more. The Premier spoke of her health issues when demanding photographers leave her alone outside her hotel in Naples, where her partner Dr Reza Adib had been attending a medical conference. This reference to her health has only fuelled that intense speculation about her future as Queensland leader and whether she may resign ahead of next year's election as her rating in opinion polls heads south. Now, a media spokesman for Ms Palaszczuk said he was unaware of any acute or chronic condition the Premier might be suffering and was quick to say there'd be no comment even if such issues were known. The staffer did concede this story is developing a life of its own and was building momentum despite the best efforts of the Queensland Health Minister, Shannon Fentiman, to play down speculation. She would be the most likely new leader. Ms Fentiman is from the party's left and would also have to topple factional ally and Deputy Premier Stephen Miles in any ballot for the top job and he too has been keen to quash any talk of this so-called uprising. But those efforts are amounting to little, Laura, as the internal rumblings within the ALP point to the need to give Labor its best possible chance of a fourth term, as the government's performance continues to be hammered over its management of youth crime, housing and health. Those who insist Anastasia Palaszczuk has checked out have already seized on her aggressive response to what she described as an intrusion upon her privacy in Italy and in particular how she reached out to block the lens of a camera when she would otherwise who might be embracing that very camera when making good news announcements and talking up the government's achievements here in Queensland.